Sean here from Data's R Us, and today's video chronicles Grant's confusion with interpreting data on a frequency table. Let's take a look at the clip. Sean, my grandkids came over this weekend, and we played a game with this new hip thing called a frequency table. The young whippersnappers tried to explain what they were doing, but I just couldn't understand. Can you help me out? Sure thing, Grands. They call me the Data Whisperer here at Data's R Us. I am pretty hip to all the new trends. I will put the document on the screen so we are able to look at it together. Thanks, Sonny. My eyes aren't as good as they used to be. What we have here is a frequency table. All the cool kids are using them. This column shows us the names of the people playing the game. As you see, Gramps, Grands, Axel, Princess, and Bob were playing. Bob was named after my great-grandfather. May he rest in peace. Nice. Back to the frequency table. This column shows us tally marks. Each tally represents the amount of times each person won the game. The frequency column of the chart tells us how many tallies are in each box. So, Gramps won 17 times. I won 8 times. Axel nine times, Princess 15, and Sweet Bob won 22 times. He always has had a knack for games. He is also always the scorekeeper. Hmm. Frequency tables can help determine information like who won the least amount of games. Looking at the chart, it looks like it was you. Who won the least amount grants? It sure was an unlucky day for me. The grandkids said they dominated us in the game this weekend. Did they win more games than Grandpa and I? To find this out, we have to first add the amount of games you and Gramps won. We add 17 plus 8 and get 25 games. Not so shabby if I do say so myself. Now we add the grandkids' scores. 9 plus 15 plus 22 for a total of 46 games. Oh man! They did dominate us. How many more games did the grandkids win than Gramps and I? Looking at the data we just found, we would need to find the difference or subtract the amount of games you and Gramps won from the amount of games the grandkids won. So what's holding you back? Get subtracting. Right away, Grants. 46 minus 25 equals 21 games. They almost had double the amount of wins as you at Gramps. These frequency tables sure have a lot of information in them. The biggest lesson learned is Gramps and I have some practicing to do before the grandkids visit again. I don't take lightly to lose into those young whippersnappers. Good luck to you, Grants. Visit us again here at Data's R Us.